the one back here and I put it through. Mm -hmm. And I screw it back on so I don't forget which side it goes on. Yeah. All right. And when you're putting it back on like this, you obviously don't have to screw it on all the way because you're going to have to take it off again. Uh -huh. And then I just coil these up uh, neatly. And then when you get about here, you can start just doing this kind of wrapping it on itself okay. like this. And then it stores up in a nice little coil like that, right? right? And then I got, uh, where's my little guys? I got my little guys here. This one already came off. See, these go in, you can see right here. So you got your lower ones going right here and the upper ones going up top. Mm -hmm. And these, the way these little things work, Paul, they're just little T heads. Yeah. So it goes in perpendicular and then turn it parallel. Okay, perpendicular to parallel and then it snaps in there. Cool. And part of the reason you got to put the bungees down below is because if you don't put a little tension on them, they'll fall right out of there when you're lifting the mast. Yeah, and then, yeah, then you got to bring it back down again. So the, putting that tension on with the bungee cord is really important. Because uh, otherwise, you'll get the mast up and you go, darn it, it fell out. And then you got to bring it back down. So, yeah, just coil them up.